what's going on folks? Century Mad Collector here. Your Prince of Plastic has returned once again with another hunt video. Man, oh man, oh man. It is a scorcher here in New York. It is hot as ball sake up in this thing. and uh, But that's a good thing. That's a good thing because in less than a week, I will be in Naples, Florida with my girlfriend, my girlfriend's family, and what is that? What the hell is that? Do you guys hear that? Something inside my car or something? What? Wait. Wait. What? You're in the wrong hood now, homie. So about to. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what's going on, people? Century Mad Collector here. Your Prince of Plastic has returned once again with another hunt video, and we are on vacation, baby. My girlfriend and I are heading down to Florida tomorrow to visit her family, um, and I am also going to be visiting a couple of uh, extended family, some of my good buddies uh, in the toy community. You may have heard of them. My buddy Mike, the OG geek, the OG cookie thief. And my buddy Seth, Mr. What's Poppin' from MCE, and hopefully Dr. Stankenstein, Mr. Stank himself, George El Jefe from MCE. Hopefully he'll be joining us as well. Uh, but I will be linking up with those guys. This has been a very long time in the making. I've been uh, friends with those guys and speaking to them for literally for years now, prior, long before I ever started a YouTube channel. And uh, it's just really going to be fun. I am absolutely pumped. Uh, to be able to get down there and spend some time in the Florida heat. Speaking of the Florida heat and things that just make me sweat, that's why, you know, I think from the time of the intro to now, there was a wardrobe change. It just, I had to run inside. I had to go change. It just, the idea of, the idea of heading down to Florida just makes me sweat. The, 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 the thought of the Florida heat makes me sweat. The amount of money uh, that I'm going to be spending uh, makes me sweat uh, when I'm with Mike and, and Seth. I know I'm going to be making some real a-hole purchases uh, down there, some vintage toys that I don't have the opportunity up here to, to see in person and buy. So just the Amex is on fire. I can feel that. That makes me sweat. And the idea of Mike and Seth eating salads, definitely, that does a lot of different things to me. Uh, none of them good. Uh, and that makes me sweat. And so very disturbing. And uh, so I had to just change out of my tank top into another shirt and just really try and control myself. Uh, so here we are, we're in a shirt now with sleeves and uh, we're gonna do a little warm up uh, prior to Florida. So the Clone Wars figures that we all know uh, are out and about. It seems like people are finding them. Shout out to everybody that's finding them. I'm hoping I can get my hands on some. And uh, we're gonna check, first we're going to check the target in Stamford, Connecticut. Uh, that target has been very kind to me with wrestling, with Star Wars, um, and when nobody's with Motu, when nobody's looking, that place has everything. So we're, we are going to check up, uh, at the Stamford target and hopefully find these figures, all uh, these Clone Wars figs, um, grab a coffee off camera. We're not going to do the talk, coffee talk thing today. Uh, and then we're going to head back up to Westchester. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe we hit another store. Maybe we don't. I don't know. Um, but we're going to do a little warm up with uh, one or two stores here to check on some Clone Wars figs. And then I will see you guys in Florida. So without further ado, folks, before we get to Florida and we sweat, 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 or sweat any more than I have already, YouTube is fun and fun is YouTube. I will see you in Stamford, Connecticut. Alrighty, here we go. Target in Stamford, which I am never at during the week, midweek, always here on weekends. Oh, Amber Collection, this is new for me. Um, I'm always here on like Saturdays when it's busy, so it's nice and quiet here. Hopefully we find some stuff. I've got some. Put it back on the peg. John Raymond, Jeff Goldblum, Velociraptor. Cool, got some stuff. I've seen this thing here forever. Indominus Rex is down there. Monsters Inc. I don't know about that. What else we got? 
from down into Master's Land. E-Man Skeletor, Battle Cat, and this Panther that's been here for a very long time. LeBron James. Here we go, Star Wars, what we got here? This has been a Star Wars gold mine for me. Um, I don't see any Clone Wars stuff though, unfortunately. Got some Moff Gideon and Apollo Creed Star Wars. And this place has just ha has had this wave unlock. Cover tanks, all that's left. Got the Deluxe Boba. John Cena, I can't see him. Right here though. Wow. Another Vader. Another Vader. Now lots of John Cena's. Got a Razor, Series 7. Overstock somewhere. Tonka behind him. And I don't see what we're looking for, unfortunately. So let's go look around and check some Marvel Legion. Eh? Got some LeBron end cap, Jiu-Jitsu stuff. And all sorts of Peg Guardian. Thank you, Wade. And I'm gonna flip back around to check DC because this aisle has got stuff going on. So we'll check DC. Real big time bummer. No Star Wars yet, at least. No Star Wars yet. Real bummer. Um, I'm gonna stop here on the way. Some of the new Lego stuff Scout Trooper, Bust, TIE Fighter, Bust. I think that's. A Target exclusive? Let me know in the comments. I want to say that it is. I'm sure that this tree mold, uh, mold, this tree structure has been used for other stuff for sure. I had a, uh, a bigger version of that from the Lord of the Rings back in the day when that first came out and I was collecting Lego. Um, but let's see. Oh, DC is occupado at the moment. However, we can check all of this wrestling in cap. What we got here? Another Vader, dude. What the hell? <laughs> now he's here. And this end cap, this is wacky. Vader is in the house. For sure. While we wait for DC, might as well check some Hot Wheels, Overwatch. Interesting. Vegas Street Fighter. Hot Wheels car. I've seen this for a while. Grave Digger Grim. Got a new one, I think, out as well. But let's go check DC. I think we're uh, all clear there. And then once we check DC, we will uh, we'll go hit uh, NECA and see what's up. Let's see, what do we wait for? Nothing. Literally. Nada. Nada. Okay, here we go, Transformers. Someone in the comments section of my last hunt video said my channel sucks because I looked at every toy. He said he, like I'm not reading it. Um, like I'm not reading the comments. He looks at everything, but skips Transformers, this channel. Well, this channel sucks. Okay, here we go. Grimlock, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. What else we got here? Optimus Prime, one Mississippi. I'm just screwing around. All right. Some of these are very cool. I just am not going to be collecting this stuff, but I do like a lot of this that I, that I am seeing. I used to collect this as a kid. I just, as an adult collector, never translated over into uh, adult collecting for me. But here's your Transformers. Hopefully, my channel doesn't suck anymore. I got some Joes. Scarlet. I've been seeing her a lot. Roadblock. And I think that's going to do it for here. Why don't we go check NECA? Heading down the long walk over to NECA. They never make it easy, these targets. What do we got? We got Bam, Fat Dune. Got some Witcher, Geralt. 
Arden Brad glass. We got some, some of that stuff. Butcher figs. We've got some of Frankie. We have this. Awesome. I need young Frankenstein. There you go. Another young Frankie. Son of Frankie. I wish it was. That was a 40 slip. I wish it was a uh, young Frankie. Super 7 reactions. Not much else going on here, folks. We've got an abandoned cart of what looks like, in my opinion, junk. Gundam. Cool. Um. I think that's probably going to do it for this store. No Clone Wars figs. Bummer time. Uh, some pops real quick. Oh, Zombie Modoc. That's the first time I'm seeing that. It's pretty cool. Dilbert. Pop. That's awesome. Splinter. Yeah, man. I think we're done. So here I have all of these. The horror Super 7. Well, sorry. I thought they were going to be all <laughs> horror Super 7. Um, but I do have all of these. I have none of these. I used to have, I have none of the Power Rangers and I used to have all of the turtle reactions, but at some point you gotta draw a line. This stuff gets silly after a while. What's this? Oh, definitely don't want this at all. All right. Yo, what's going on people? It is later in the day today. I actually had given up on hunting. As you saw, we went to Stamford, Connecticut earlier in the day. We struck out. Uh, I then went ahead and went to the gym, got myself a haircut, and on my way to the haircut, uh, my buddy, shout out to Legends Collector, he sent me a DM um, on my way to getting a haircut that I couldn't back out of uh, at that point, and he was like, yo, I heard through a friend, uh, the entire wave, the entire wave of Clone Wars figures is at the Palisades Mall Target. And of course, that's the Target I was thinking of maybe going to first before I did anything today. And of course, I did not. Um, but apparently, as of two hours ago, two hours plus ago, uh, the entire Clone Wars wave um, was there, fully stocked on the shelves. Bam, 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 bam. Right in a row. Uh, so now we have over two hours later. Uh, I'd be happy if there was one of those figures left. I don't know. Uh, but we are going to head over to the Palisades Mall. Uh, head over to Target in the Palisades Mall. Since it is also very close to my home. So it's kind of perfect as long as this works out. And uh, see what they got. This is the uh, Target that is remodeling right now. They don't have a NECA section. Um, they're all over the place. So it's interesting that they have this stuff in, but apparently it's in the main toy aisle with all the Star Wars stuff. So let's go check it out. Do we even... All right, we'll stop and take a look at this stuff first. As long as there's no one else in this aisle, okay. Don't need anyone now. Potentially, I am so paranoid right now, but here's Dinos. I was gonna say there, I don't need anyone potential. Oh yes, potentially taking this. Potentially taking this stuff away from me. My God. We got Hawk. We got lots of Hawks. Got all Hawk. Interesting. And all Anakin, it looks like. I'm definitely going to be taking one of these. I know that. Oh, wow. Short Trooper. Death Trooper. Let's use another one of these. And another one of these. I think. Um, I was going to say, another Raider. Pretty stocked in here. My buddies, uh, the Poppin' Couple, and my buddy, the Insane Goon, I know, want these almost more than I do, so I'm going to pick up a couple of these for them. That is awesome. Edge. Bunny suit Enan, John Cena. All right, let's go flip around and check Marvel Legends just to show you guys. You know, there's nothing I'm really looking for right now. This is uh, the Motu stuff with LeBron James. But uh, man, this is awesome. And Marvel for DC. You can dig in a little bit here. But. Oops. 
got back on top of this house of cards. But it's the main build figure wave. Got some transformers. What's this? I don't know. Like I always say in the comments, you guys can tell me when it comes to this Grimlock is very cool, actually. Star screen. We got some reactions here. Three and three quarter. What do we got? Absurd $17.99 price point, but these are pretty awesome. I will say that. What's going on in here? Anything new? Pretty fully stocked on Transformers at this place. And you got these like minis, I guess. I really don't know anything about them. Transformers line since I do not collect them. But, uh, my God, what the F? Pretty nice collection, though. Huffer. Uh, Warpath. I don't know how much I've seen him around. Um, got some uh, death metal stuff. The usual Rangers assortment. I remember when those two bad guys down there, King Sphinx and Pumpkin Raptor, were impossible to find around here. Uh, some pair of Star Screams, the Jitsu, and the uh, classic Peg Guardians. Shang-Chi, all sorts of Shang-Chi, except for, uh, I don't see any death dealers back there. Got a mix of Shang-Chi, still man wave. Well, this stuff, do we even need that? No, we don't. Um, I think that's gonna do it. Oh, let's, oh, they don't have a NECA section, by the way. Let me show you guys this. This is uh, actually pretty crazy. I spotted this um, a week ago. I posted it um, on my Instagram page, but uh, I'm about to show you where the NECA section used to be you everything that they have so fully stocked you know as usual the collector spot obviously and this is what we got fellas this is apparently turning into like the shipping department for some reason reason on reasons unknown so right now there is no NECA everything's in the back this place is going through like a major remodeling phase and uh, we have no NECA at this place but We've got Clone Wars figures, and that's really all we came for and all that matters, so mission accomplished. Hey, Mikey. Hey, Sethi. Put those salads down, boys. I'm coming. It's time. <laughs> Wait. Wait. What? You're in the wrong hood now, homie. So about to. <laughs> <laughs> this is our local watering hole. This, this is one of. This is the main, the main place that I go to for hot toys. Hot toys. Hot this toys. is. This has been years in the making. I've seen this place on your channel and this gentleman's channel. Yeah. For so long, I can't believe we're back to. I'm about to walk in with these two goons, <laughs> goons. and see what they have. <laughs> okay, we're all done filming our intros. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. I think we're almost done. Uh, are we almost done? We're almost done. We got one to go. We got two one. hours on his. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Two hours on his. Two seconds on mine, and then we'll oh, see how long. Excuse me for giving the people what they want. <laughs> this is perfectionism. So we're gonna we're gonna finish filming intros, and then we're going to uh, hit some tates to see what they got. And we got shrubbery. Oh, dra oh yeah, we got crate the wildlife down here, dude. Yeah. Those cane frogs, like, can't have dogs outside past eight, 8 p.m. Dude, you get all you, you get uh, what we call uh, Florida chickens, which are basically like these giant, humongous iguanas. Yeah, these things are huge, dude. I've never heard of those. See, look, 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 look. Oh, he's there, gone. There he is, folks. Folks, an OG geek, a wild OG. Crikey, would you look at that bloke? A wild OG geek in his element. I think he's walking to New York to take the intro. I don't know where. <laughs> 
All right, so we're going to jump into Tate's. As far as we're concerned, we'll see you like that. Look, I got my mask. got my mask. Okay. He's got... Oh, oh. America. You can't say he's not patriotic. Uh, okay. Oh, oh, excuse me. We're being, we're being summoned. In short time, then, Tate's. Here's, like, all their newer, their newer stuff. Got our tour guide here. Got some figures, Spawn figures, Batman stuff. Yeah. Luke Farland. Bill and Fitz. Oh, no way. Look at this. This is awesome. Huh. Imagine these cards. Or I destroy the card. Very cool. Got some black, got some black series stuff. Oh, the retro series. We got all this stuff in the most deranged way possible at Target. Yeah. Any Cara Dunes in the house? No. no dude, this is such a good figure. If they did have Cara Dunes, they'd probably be reselling them for like 140 bucks. Yeah, no doubt. Black series, the usual stuff, Great. nothing too. Here's the, uh oh. Here's is the this the infamous? This is the world famous Hot Toys case. So here's, here is Seth's case. I basically have bought everything that's in here. That's why it's so empty. That's why I'm surprised you gave this place a skid D. So many. So many Hot Toys purchases out of this case. Right? I know, right? Just buy the case. I, I told them that. I was like, is there any way I could ever just buy the case? And they're like, sorry, sir. <laughs> sorry, sir, your money's no good here. Yeah. Samurai Bat is pretty cool. Oh, man. Now, this is the sort of hijinks that is oh, just. Yeah. Oh, man. Superstars. Finding more. Oh, my. This is. Terry the King. Tito Santana. Oh, this is. Uh, yeah, freaking Signature Series Hawk. Awesome. We've got another Hawk. Like, these are, like, super hard to find right now. Oh, yeah. You know, everybody's on that Legion of Doom uh, head train. Yes. That's big Daddy. Drool. Oh, look at this, Jerry. I've never seen this one before. This is cool. You just made the list, Jericho. Oh, wow. Yeah, you don't really see too many of those. Ever, actually. It's the whole list of Jericho on the back. Oh, that's, that's funny. Beefcake right there, Sting. Oh, you got Pete, oh, you got Pete Doom. Stuff in here. We're gonna get a, a Beefcake coming. I don't know, poor, poor Double Team Dream. Oh, he was man. just released. Yeah. A couple of guys, actually, just another little wave, right? Got Samoa, this DDP. Got match. Match. DDP. Dean Malenko, Jesus. Oh my God. Oh, we got, where we got? Brutus. Young Dean Malenko, that hairline is pretty good on him. We got Brutus, we got Lord Steven Regal. We got Rick Rude in the back. Ooh, let's see Rick. Oh, look at this. Oh, shit. The Rick's dropping shit. That's, you know, off the rails already, five minutes into oh, this. Oh, look at that sting. That's, that's actually, look at that. That's, that's, that's a good, that's a good looking sting. It is a good looking sting. It, or, or as my buddy, uh, Matt Cardona would say, stang. <laughs> that's right, folks, we're friends. <laughs> Cesaro's back there. Oh, and he's got the Cesaro section sign. That's awesome. Got some defining moments mm -hmm. up here. I have this actually shot from my buddy Joe. Got me oh, that. Oh, yeah, look at that. Birthday a while ago. Shinsuke. That's Cena, Shinsuke. Piper, Bobby Roode. Does this, this even work? Lots still? of very big Randy Orton. The young Orton over there. Some Budios. <laughs> Headbangers, man, this is yeah, look at this. Oh, bone crunchers. Uh oh. Holland, uh, Holland, Holland, I gotta uh, take a look at those. Hall and Ash two pack. That's fantastic too. I'm gonna have to dig through this stuff off camera for sure. But you guys are getting a really good glimpse of some awesome vintage wrestling oh, right now. Oh, sorry. Oh, they got more stuff in here. Freaking oh, Warrior Shango. and Papa Shango. Holy moly. Gallows and, and Anderson. Man, this is. Now they got bots and uh, oh, nasty. nasty boys. Yeah, dude, this got is... some basics down here. Basic bill. It's actually that's a nice warrior. Gold dust. Man, this is uh some start for this hunt. APA. Oh boy, look at that, Ron Simmons and that other jerk. Here's shield three pack. 125. Oh, Jesus. Wow. Erwin R. Got the IRS in the house. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Look at the last one. Oh yeah. 
looking at the last one. Oh, Bob Orton. I have, I have that Bob Orton. You are the odd man out. You should watch wrestling. Don't have that Heenan. I have it. They have those, those plaques no, are mixed like up. Bobby <laughs> Heenan is this guy. Bob Orton yeah. is that guy. Um, but it's cool that they have some of these LJNs. I'm an LJN guy, and I will probably be buying some at some point on this trip. Bootios. If you ain't got this, you ain't booty. It's part of the uh, weight loss challenge diet plan. Gotta have bootios. Make sure to hit that boot. <laughs> that Cthulhu bust is very cool. It's like a random cabinet of stuff. Got some pops over here. Professor Hulk is pretty cool. Man, we've made it maybe 10 feet into this place and I'm already at a standstill. So we've got this guy over here filming stuff. So I'm going to go, turtles, that's it. I'm going to join the turtle penis party in a moment. Turtle penis forever! <laughs> but look at this stuff. We are looking at vintage Motu right here. King Randor, Snout Spout, Tila, wow. Shout out to my buddy Zombie Sailor. Had an incredible historic sale about a year or so ago with some of these figures. These turtles? And those cards are looking... Mint. I would not open these. I won't be buying them, but I like to look for beat up stuff. Oh, look at this. Mint loose. Is it how? Are they mint? Minty? They complete? Wow. Oh boy, this is going to be a major problem. Store one. This is not good for me. This guy already wants to buy everything. Spike or I do. This is bad. <laughs> this is really bad. Oh man, Clawful's up here, looks complete, jeez. Oh boy, boy oh boy oh boy. Oh, we got vehicles too, Shizer. This is amazing. Grayskull, oh my God. All of you vintage guys, enjoy. This is crazy stuff. Things that I don't see back home at all. Some rock lords, this is also awesome. Boglins, oh, let's get these. It's a sensory overload. And right next to me, there's a case of Joe's. Awesome. We got some of the re-releases from, eh, not too long ago. Seven, eight, nine years ago. Some loose figures. This is amazing. I would need that gun. This is crazy. Hey, turtle dick section. Yeah, this is April. Some pops. What do you got going on up here? Ghostbuster thermos. I know. The artwork on all of them is so good. I actually like the boxes more than the things that come in the box. I know. <laughs> I mean, even the boxes are expensive, empty these days. It's crazy. But uh, I have a psycho cycle, and like I want to open it, but like the box art alone is just amazing. Look at these two mooks over here. Yeah. Hi. What you call me? We Hi. Oh, gee, Century doing their thing. Oh, Carousing the, uh, the turtle dicks. This is, oh man, turtle dicks on fire. That's right what I'm now. saying, man. Turtle dicks on fire. <laughs> <This is> insane. <laughs> dicks on fire. Oh. See, now we're doing Inception. You're recording me, I'm recording you. It's Inception. First time ever for right. Channel right. first. Channel first, everybody. Inception right here happened. It's an out of body experience, <laughs> I will say that. There's some turtle comics. There's some more of the vintage stuff. Some more of the Transformers. Man, this place is just loaded with stuff. Hot Wheels, there you go, Jersey Geek. Mike are having our own section moment. <laughs> Let our cameras touch. Huh. Man. <laughs> just been letting this one ride. There's just uh, so much stuff to look at. And, uh, yeah. Some Game of Thrones. It's Gandalf. It's 
stand on? You shall not buy me! Yeah. Yeah, I think I think we are gonna listen to that. You want a proton pack? What is a I want to go as Ghostbusters. Me and my friends were going to do that like years ago. We wound up doing 90s wrestlers instead. I think that wound up working out, but you know, Ghostbusters Halloween, close to 40 years old. I think it's done. <laughs> Got some selects here. Jane, Silent Bob, Bruce Lee. I've actually never seen this Bruce Lee. It's pretty nice, yeah, actually. It's pretty cool. Oh no, Spawn oh, stuff. Yeah. Look at all of this. Man, my left arm is tired right now. <laughs> my left arm is tired. From filming, that's all. Oh, hey, Nothing hey, else. Hey, hey. All right? Hey. You know? I'm dropping stuff. <laughs> really cool. Man. Young blood. There's just so much stuff here, guys. I, I mean, I can't even begin to describe. We just walked in here too, so it's ridiculous. You know this guy, we have him, Mandarin Spawn. And for you Spawn heads, there's plenty of stuff here. Me being one of them. I love me some vintage Spawn. Very cool. What else do we got? It's just everywhere you turn. This place is much bigger than I realized. Got some Power Ranger stuff. Got some Godzilla. Some Rangers that we've seen before. Got some Bandai Rangers down here. And if we take a little Walk ski all the way down. Oh man, these are so bad. <laughs> these are terrible. These are some of the worst figures ever made. Yeah, do you, you've seen these obviously. Oh, yeah. They're so bad. Oh yeah, they're they're horrible. Oh yes. Well, who is that? That's Kinder. I don't know who that is. Oh. It's definitely not. Kinder. Well, well, I mean, look at look at look at this one. I, yeah, I don't know what what's going on here. This dude has got some serious problems. Saber tooth. Look at Black, look at Black Widow. Oh, these are just horrible. They are. And you got all of them here, so if anyone's into it, come to Tate's. Dude, this place is so much bigger than yeah, I realized. Yeah, what's per perceived in the video. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got the, the Cabinet of Doom over there, so like my head's always just like, you yeah. know, hot toys and... Exactly. But holy crap. That's all I show, that's all I show off, basically, for the most part. I only show off the stuff I'm interested in. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. Yeah, if that wasn't the case, I could be here all day filming. Oh, I know, I know. This is uh, pretty amazing. You got all of these selects down here. The what if cap, Daredevil, that's a good one. I always like the dials with this very deranged looking Magneto. Got some two packs, some legends. You got a little legend stack. Wow, this is pretty, pretty cool. Old cards, Toy Biz Marvel. Got an OG. What's up? Yeah, this place is big. I was just telling Seth, dude. Huh? This place is huge. Yeah. It's much bigger than I thought. It's a lot to take in. It, it, it is a lot. Have you seen the Baby Yoda the Hot Toy yet? No. Where's that at? Pretty dope. The Star Wars section over there. We haven't even gotten to that section. My God. Let's check out some hot toys. Oh, these are in the case. Why do you feel better in the case? Oh, out there displayed, right? War Machine, I've definitely seen these. What is this? These are loose selects and legends, I guess. Cool. Very cool. Might have to go take a look at uh, that Star Wars section. This might be a four and a half hour video. <laughs> awesome. Wow. Hey, baby. Look at this. Hey, baby, Yoda. How you doing, buddy? Life size. We got some, uh... What are you talking to? Huh? Talking to baby Yoda. It's like he's in the class. Got some big-time trust issues after that intro, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, 
apart from my metal plates. So, are you all like on, uh, are you on like super awesome. overload right now? I, I can't, I'm not even, I'm actually not even speaking now. I'm like yeah. drooling from the mouth and yeah. giggling and I don't even know. He's just recording in silence. Yeah, <laughs> at, at this point, I don't even know what silence, to say. Silence, Hot toys, we have these, which yeah. is cool. Um, I'm just enjoying watching watching uh, Ron take all this all take right. all this in. I, I I can't take it in, and then film. It's just like. And sometimes it is hard to take it in. It is. It is because I still haven't even I have to go through and see what I want. Yeah. Because I'm not walking out of here empty handed. It's only the first door. Yeah, it's only the first door. I know. Door. I pace yourself. I know. Yeah. I can't. I dude, never. Never for it's like me. Look wallet, at this. The wallet ready to jump out of his pocket. It's so bad. <laughs> Look at this. Is my kind of case right here, vintage Kenner. Oh man, we just saw some of this on my channel that we discovered an amazing once in a lifetime collection. We got Ben Kenobi carded. Looks like it's unpunched. That's awesome. Got some troopers here. All cased up. Ben Kenobi, Luke. I've got the, I mean, I found a Vader. In the part of that collection has like telescope sabers too, which is amazing. Imperial Storms, Hammerhead, Greedo, Sand Person, Tuscan Raider, Snaggletooth, Jawa, C3PO, not as chromed as he should be, but I, and this is all really awesome stuff. Double downing for all you vintage folks right now. This is great. Might see if, I don't know. Like I said, I have all the, I mean, that collection, that toy was the stuff I've purchased and there are a couple of other things I'm gonna purchase too, but I'm gonna check this case and see anyway, if there's anything I could snag that would make sense. And now you have the six scale stuff from Star Wars here. Mike, you eyeing anything? Are you good? No, I'll do anything I need except for that. It's awesome. More over here. It doesn't end. Right, I think I'm gonna put the, oh shit. Right. Put my back on that. Yeah, I'm bumping in. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, never mind. No, was he working out somewhere? Uh -huh. The last one they had here was, uh, Uh, oh, there's your hard drive? Did he? Oh, God. Let's try it. Discount right there. Talking feature doesn't work. They actually are playing Seth in here, stereo surround sound. <laughs> That's the status he's on here. We got more Black Series. Man, there's just so much. And that range troopers. This is actually very cool. That's awesome. Yeah. Oh, there's so much. Sounds like I just want to take it all. <laughs> I, I do. Problem. Power of the Force. Here we go. Well, we've definitely all seen this stuff before. I'm good on that. I'm good on that. Classic green and black Power of the Force stuff. Expanded universe figs. I mean, it just doesn't end. Episode one, now we're talking. I have all these. This kind of looks like Edge. Quite on. <laughs> With the Comtech uh, chips. Pika, 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 pika. Didn't they ban you guys from collectible shops already, or what's going on? Oh, hey. <laughs> Man, it's just this is endless. It's amazing stuff. And the Star Wars selection here is excellent. So, hope you guys are enjoying all this. This is uh, pretty unbelievable.
But I think at this point, oh my God, what we got here, Revenge of the Sith. This is all very reminiscent, this packaging of the new Clone Wars uh, figures that just came out. Just smaller, but same thing, really. And I think that's gonna do it for Tate's. If I wind up buying anything in here, I will definitely be showing you guys. But uh, man, this was store one down. My God, well, look at this. What's going on here? What the hell is going on here? Do not touch. I was about to touch it. But. To quote Big Dub, I was about to touch it. You ever see, uh, you ever see Finding Nemo? And he's masked, yeah. Here, I touched the butt. <laughs> Pretty cool. All masked up. Very safe here at Tate's. Got another case of... Yeah, this, oh, is, this, is all com this is all comics and stuff, yeah. Yeah, we, I just, we can't right now. <laughs> More Spawn. There's vintage OG, some of this stuff in here. Mm -hmm. You got your Spawn. Tales of the Crypt. This is awesome. This is really, really cool stuff. Well, stop number two. The world famous bits and buttons. Here it is. I am very scared. My and, wallet is and, even more frightened. Just, just to let everybody know in the YouTube stratosphere universe, the type of pull I have because of my clout, my status, as I like to call it. Um, they're actually closed today. And I'm making them open specially just for you. For me? For you. Just for me? Just for you. This is... I love this man. <laughs> this is even worse. I contacted the owner, Dominic, and I got him to open it, especially, especially for... for uh, yeah, bits and Buns is uh, normally closed on Wednesdays, but you know, you come chill with us, you get the VIP treatment. Yay. <laughs> Very important penis. <laughs> so that's, you heard, of, you, right, you heard it here from the head honcho, from the horse's mouth. <laughs> <laughs> this place is closed, but now it's open for us. And I have no excuse whatsoever right, guys, to not buy something. I don't think I'm going to need much of an excuse. This uh, this place is, it's been on my list for so long to come to this place. That door is a very dangerous door that we're about to step into. You guys are in for a big time treat. I am 1000% buying stuff. So it's just a matter of how much and what. Here's the door. The door to poverty. All right, well, this is... Uh, as good of a place to start as ever. We've got one turtle cabinet that I've seen so often on both of these guys' channels. There's a lot of stuff in here in this store that, oh, sorry, Leo, that we are going to dig into today. Oh, man. Oh, boy. That looks like it's in very good condition, too. Okay. Looks like we've got some graded vintage turtles, unpunched wrath. I actually have an unpunched wrath. It's not graded though. And a leather head. That's awesome. That's amazing. Got some musical mutagen tour stuff. Some more turtles. These we usually pass up on. I'm good here. No, no, no. But, uh, I mean, this is two feet into the store. It's already jam packed with turtles. Oh, he's one of my favorites. I have him mint on card. I picked him up at uh, this guy up. He's one of my favorite villains. But I would, this is an opener for me. I don't know. Something to think about. Because the one I have on card, I'm not touching. <coughs> That's mint pizza face. <clears throat> Why don't you go oh just, no! Oh, I'm just saying. I mean, it's right there. Just saying. You know, I was trying to ease into the <laughs> freaking stuff, dude. Oh my god! Here it is. I am scared to even. I who knows? Look, it's. Oh, it's free. I don't see a price tag. It's free. Oh. Graded scratch. Let's get the keys. Okay. You, can you let's just <laughs> help me pick this thing up and we'll walk out here. Wow! There he is. There he is. This man knows. Mm -hmm. I've been eyeing that. Mm -hmm. This man knows. That would be incredible to have. He's graded. That's uh, gotta be 
not yeah. cheap. Um, so if, oh, we got to ask how not cheap it is. You know? Oh, we're definitely going to ask how not cheap it is. Um, so I love about this place. All the loose fingers, too. This is the other thing, too. Stuff, yeah. I love the, yeah, and you have all this stuff loose, which I'm definitely going to dig into. And I've and never seen as good many, condition. like, there's a lot of stores around here that have a lot of, like, loose figures, but not as many as this, and definitely not as many vehicles. Oh, and I've loose. never, oh, you got the news van. Yeah, yeah, we went through this with all the vehicles. I, I don't, I mean... Techno drone, I mean, a little bit of everything. And that looks like it's in phenomenal yes, condition. Yeah, it's in good shape. Um, yeah, dude, I, I don't know. I got to find out about that scratch. Depending on what that is, that might be the only thing I'll walk away with. If it's going to cost some scratch. No, sure. it's, it's going to cost some real scratch. But you got this entire case. And then you flip around and... As we just saw before, all this loose stuff. Look at this. All these Mondos. In good condition, too. These loose figures are in good condition. Amazing. And then my wife, she's just like, I fucking ain't sleeping. Donnie? Yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah, these are all in very good condition. What do you know? I'm not sleeping. Bebop and no, Rock. I don't want to get one of those those sleep numbers. Yeah, so it's like. Oh, man. Got all the Super Seven Ultimates down, down here. Oh, shit. Now I got. I got well stocked there. Here. Video game Baxter, looking good. We have all that stuff. I actually order those. Um, Dealing with plantation. Here's the start of some Star Wars. They get Got some vintage Kenner right here. What's this? Wow, these prices are, uh, those are the amazing. Monster eyes. The monster what? I showed you those, the shinings. Oh, yeah, look yeah, at the. I got, two uh, more those, like, got a bunch of Ugnots. Like some Adats, some Tuscan Raiders. So what's up, man? See so you're out and about this week. They all look like they're in really good condition. You can see the glare. Me and the shirt. Nice. These look like they're mint, loose, and complete. Just guy trying to sell me some garbage, dude. Rob's like, I want it all. I, I do. This is, <laughs> it's not good. Yeah, the, uh, uh, Grievous uh, up here. Yeah, oh, there you go. You got a carrying case. Did I tell you what I did? Got a couple of them, actually. It looks yeah, like, you, you can see back there. there. <laughs> One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Very yeah, cool. He hasn't messaged me yet. Oh, okay. But I saw he tagged me. He posted Bad Batch, last night Bad Batch, Bad Batch, Mando. The wrestling figures that I sent them? Yeah, he posted us last night. Oh, so he got these from me. Clone Wars. Yeah, so I gotta get so some older black some series. Some nice little wall right here. Either Friday. Shore Trooper used. That's what his deal is see? For, next, for next week. That's and nice that. I'm gonna ask him too. Like I'm gonna it's tell him to like, on Patreon when, when that video. You know what you're getting here. So that's always it, good. A ton of archive yeah, stuff. Well, I always it's it's it's, 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 proper, it's proper editing. This is all. We've seen this like, on the channel a lot. Like, can I join my, the Some retro program. and vintage I don't care, okay. just, that makes stuff. Sense. I don't want people. No, but it's 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 right thing to do. It's, yeah. it's etiquette. Because you have Wrestling Universe in there. And you I, the it's time, universe. folks. We're walking into here's some Toy Biz Marvel. We'll go over some of this, but this is one cabinet that I really could not wait to go through in person. Vintage wrestling. You've got. A nice, hearty mix of LJN, Hasbro's, and Galoob figures. See those Ron Simmons down there, the Steiners. And as we move up, I'm going to tell you, got some Mattel stuff. Here's some LJN loose. So I have that Steamboat. I have, uh, let's see what else. I have that Beefcake back there. I don't have that mean gene. That's one thing Hasbro should have done, was make uh, refs and managers. They never did that. You got Flair carded, looking nice. Clear bubble and everything. Back over to the Galoob, some of the Galoobs. Galoob Sting, Luger, into Hasbro. Warrior, I have that. I don't have Sid though. And as we move down, we're starting to get into some real heavy heat. Graded Hasbro's. Wow. Kamala. The Moonbelly. <laughs> Steamboat. Steiner. Duggan. 
Gonzalez, Crush, Coco. Here's a closer look at some of the other Hasbros. I, ha I have a lot of these. Um, all on card, but there are beater cards, mint figures with beater cards that I will be opening up. But you got the Rockers, Hurricane, and Typhoon and Earthquake, whatever. I got the wrong natural disaster for a second. <laughs> Piper, DiBiase, Boss. I mean, you've got a perfect back there. You've got a Razor. It's like a blue carded Razor. A couple of Hogans. Got a Series 1 Hogan. So this is just an incredible, incredible wrestling case up here. We have some defining moments. Got a Macho Man. Rock. I mean, this is amazing. And this looks like we have a vintage King of the Ring, which looks like it's in phenomenal condition, actually. Extremely hard to find. Not bad at all. Those replace those stickers, but... The actual ring looks really good. You got a glue butch, butch reed. This is... Rounds like, rounds like I'm in wrestling heaven. So, oh my god, man. We've got that. King of the Ring, dude, looks yeah. great. That's in fantastic condition. Yeah, it's pretty clean. Yeah, it's got the autographed Hawkins, Hawkins in there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got all the great, all the graded, LG, all the old graded LGN stuff. Yeah, it got the Hasbro stuff, the yeah. LJN stuff. You got, dude, the graded Hasbro stuff looks fantastic. I don't, yeah. I mean, I'm doing all the off card, but like, yeah. I don't know. This yeah, he's is, got uh, the Kamala. He's got Crush. He's got Crush. Yeah. The Giant Gonzalez. Yep. Hacksaw. Yeah. All those guys. Amazing. And then on, and then we have Loose. Look yeah, at all this got, Loose oh, yeah, stuff. You got all the Lucies and yeah. Got loose Hasbro's. Yeah, you got a good mix of a good mix of everything. Yeah, yeah freaking macho, macho man right here. Yep, yep. This is a it's a wacky place. Actually, I, I need these guys. I need the mint though, Mr. Ryder. He's got some chases. He's got the uh, he's got the Shinsuke chases. Oh, we all we all got those Shinsuke chases. Yeah. Got the Motu WWE. Rocking over here. Got the rings up there. Man, this is endless. Bone crunching buddies. Oh, I haven't even flipped around over into this. More superstars. Oh, yeah. Holy good lord. <laughs> An oldie but goodie. Adam Rose. Oh no. Yes. <laughs> El, El Torito. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's Zeb. Yeah. Remember him? Oh my god. That didn't work. Where's uh what's his face along with him? Who? Uh, Ro oh, ja uh, Jack Alberto Swagger, Del, Del Rio, and he was yeah. Oh yeah. Wasn't he part of? Didn't he come out as whose manager was he? At he one was point? when he when he showed up. It was uh, it was uh, Jack Swagger and. Um, then they tried to do that like uh, that like whatever the yeah, nations. We the people. Well, he, yeah, that that's and what they, then that's what they used to do. And then I think he, I think he came back during like, I thought a Del Rio return. Yeah, also. he came back during the Del Rio thing. Yeah. Yeah. So much for that. But yeah, we get moving down. We got Luger. Got some Mattel stuff. You know things that we've definitely seen um, on this channel. But oh man, the Ghostbuster collection is awesome. Look at all of this. It's just so much. A lot yeah. of vintage stuff in here that we're gonna have to go through as well. Man, man, oh man, oh man. This is unbelievable. Got some Jack stuff. Yeah, boy. Wow. Taker, Rock. Oh, man. Got some old uh, WCW Toy Biz ones. Oh, my goodness. Dude, I've never Scott, seen these. Scott Hall, Goldberg. Yeah, they got Johnny the, Nitro. Who's that? Roddy Piper. I don't know who the hell this is. Remember this guy, Hack? Is that Sandman? <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, yeah, that is Sandman. <laughs> Oh yeah, he was in uh, in WCW, right? Oh my God, freaking Dennis Rodman! <laughs> Forgot about that whole thing. You got Mr. S down there. I'm an ass man. Do, do. Yeah, this is pretty incredible. We got Alf randomly in there. Wow, and more. Yeah. New Japan. 
yep. figures. Jeff Jarrett. <laughs> Slap nuts. With Deborah. Oh my God, you got freaking hardcore, hard, hardcore Holly and freaking Al Snow with head. Oh, that's awesome, actually. Oh, we got all the, we got more Jack stuff. A lot of Jacks, two packs. That rhymed. What else we got back here? Anything? Looks like it's another Deborah, double J. Man, nuts. We got a yeah. wall back here that it's we all definitely fun. don't care about. Yeah, it's the wall, the wall of Funko. Or if you want to, in my world, the wall of shame. <laughs> Back in the day when I used to collect Funkos. Hey, we all start somewhere, though. Yeah, right? I know, I know. You don't have to remind me. <laughs> Got some loose DC stuff over here. Toy Biz. And I know down here for sure, we'll get some legends in here, some older legends. Well, actually, these aren't old, these are new. We've got a mix of some old in here, some DC. Man, I mean, he's got some good legends. I mean, he's got the, the War Machine from the Hulkbuster. Yeah, from yeah, that's Hulk, a good one. From the Hulkbuster. Um, everybody's favorite shelf former, Frogman. Oh, he is definitely a peg guardian, for sure. A peg. <laughs> Guardians of the pegs. <laughs> Does it well. And then Toy Biz, some of my favorite. Toy Biz Marvel. It's definitely some of my favorite. I don't have this juggy. I always love, I love going Toy Biz Marvel hunting. Some of my favorite things to do. I might, I might have to take a look at that. I have the Spidey. I don't have the Hobgoblin from uh, the original animated uh, series line. Beast. Dropping stuff. Ugh. Put him back. His hobby. That back on the peg. Got black suit Spidey. This place is freaking loaded. Lots of vintage Marvel. I might have to take one of those beasts just because it's classic. I don't have him in the collection, so I might have to add that. And Juggernaut. Those would be solid pickups, I think. There's just so much. I wonder if they have any Toy Biz uh, Hercules from the 90s. And, and one shame on these guys. They never show me the Mego wall. The Mego wall? I don't think you saw that big droid factory. I did not see that. All right, we're going to... Pause here on the Mego. We'll be back to this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's not going anywhere. That I know. <laughs> and of course, here's the sole proprietor of this establishment. What's up, I man? Wanna, I want to get your face. There's a lot on. of there's a lot of videoing going on right now. I know. You want to you want to tell the good folks again about the event that's coming up? That's right. Oh that's right. Hold my, on. Let me, let me oh whip it out for goodness, you. Oh hey, I, hey, look at hey, all of this hey, stuff in. Hey, watch out now. All right, guys. I'm coming up and under. <laughs> Gotta do a little publicity. All right, go. so don't forget, guys, June 5th. That's right, guys. Maybe June the 5th. Stuff. Marty Abrams, is great. CEO. I am, and, uh, I'm let, overwhelmed. Let me get it even. <laughs> There's so much going on. I don't even know what to do. I don't know what to, to, know yeah. what to yeah. say. Yeah. That's great. And then you have this. I just wanted to make sure you saw it. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Because this is. Look at this. Look at this. I don't know what I'm going to do about this. I don't going to do about any of this. This display is freaking amazing, too. I love this. Definitely seen this in uh, both of your channels. Oh, you got this three-pack, too. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad news. Hmm? Very bad. Thank you. I didn't see I did not see Destroyed Factory. I figured you did it. No. It's just behind all the stuff. Thank you. I just appreciate that. Just to look that. at it. Yeah, yeah. I'm just, just to look. Dude, I'm window shopping today. Okay, just, I'm just window shopping. I don't want to... Thank you. <laughs> Got some. Three and three quarter. Star Wars. Okay. That. That's nice. I'm punched. Some retro stuff. Got Mumra. Two to four. Sign Stan Lee. Oh, look at that. Oh, we got some Motu stuff. Classic Motu. Uh, for those of you guys that cannot make it, so be 
Man. Here we've seen a lot of this stuff on the channel. We got Super 7 reactions. <laughs> seen all this sort of stuff. I really want to show you the things that we don't normally see. Which is some Joes. Definitely need to see more of that on the channel. Some animals. Look at this. So here's the Star Wars case. Loose. You've got the card too, just no blister. Interesting. What else do we have back here? Fast draw. Heavy duty. Take a look at some of this stuff. Got some vintage Joe's. Oh boy. Very, very, very cool. Oh no, it's this guy. Boglin. I'm gonna have to pass on him. And we've got Super 7. Super 7 over here. Reactions with Motu Origins. We have all this stuff. This is Super 7. We have this stuff too. I've done haul videos on my Super 7 uh, collection. I actually have this Motu carrying case. I got it at a flea market. Uh, which is in excellent condition. Um, I'm looking for the TMNT one. So let me know in the comments if you guys, any old school guys have that. Castle Grayskull playset. Oh my goodness. Some loose Motu vintage. This is... Oh, 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 okay. Me too, but dude, mine are so hard. I walked in here instantly hard. It's like, it's like ice cubes in here. Yeah, yeah. Ron's like, I just went from six to midnight. I just. <laughs> Another Motu display. Vintage. This is, this is definitely another cabinet I'm going to have to pay some serious, seriously close attention to. A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Oh, Dragon Blaster Skeletor. This is just crazy. This is uh, not much of a Care Bears guy. But if we're looking at LJM Thundercats, awesome. I would love to walk away with a Lino. Depending on that guy, looks like he's in good condition. I might have to, I'm definitely going to check that out. Wow. Very cool. Dragon Balls! Lots of. <laughs> Lots of loose vintage and Dragon Balls. Ultra Force. There's just so much going on here. Some vintage Spawn. Yo, that's, Yo. My, that's my girl, dude. Pet pig, bro. I would do all kinds of unspeakable you, things. What else do we have? Out of her shit. That is oh, the there's no question. There's no question. <laughs> well, and if you want to know who we're, who we're talking about, we're talking about Alexa Bliss. So Alexa Bliss, if you're out here and watch my videos, I would all do this vintage ungodly stuff. things to you. And Street corn style. A stri oh, yeah. Vintage Thundercats. Going to have to take a look at these. Got Mumra, Lino back there, Panthro. I second that. Got the... Um, so food dudes. Is, uh, and it's funny more the reason why we There's this is so, amazing. Was, so I we got, oh we got Dick Tracy. Oh, I love all this Dick. I might pick up some Dick Tracy stuff too. This is awesome. A ton of it also. And well priced. I love these figures. I don't care about articulation at all. I just love this vintage stuff. I might pick up some of those. Playmates, my favorite. No, of course. The toy company that is. AVP. What a toy line this one is. Got a nice selection of aliens here. Well, and then what else? Oh, wow, look at all this. Oh, man. I don't remember seeing this case. This is uh, another scary case for me. I actually met somebody not too long ago. Holy moly. Look at all of this. This is so bad. 
for me in my wallet. Amazing yes. stuff, though. Take another quick look, guys, and then... Like some of the food pigs, like we do. You walk them, like, uh, you know, oh, there's Gung Ho. Oh. And Mind Bender. Power Rangers. Oh, man. Like a cat. Think about it. A cat and Transformers. I think. Ultra Magnus. Come full circle. Here he is. Oh. There he is. Another out of body experience here. It's, oh, God. It's it feels an inception. So good. It's inception. It, it feels so good. It, you're inside me and I'm inside you. Oh, that, God. Well, that didn't sound right. And on that note. <laughs> hey, look. And by the way, there's dick. It's <laughs> di oh, look, Tons of dude. <laughs> loaded tons of with dick. dick. He's got dick everywhere. Look at all. That's a lot of dick. I actually might. Dick. I might grab some dick, to be honest, <laughs> before I leave. All I right, love folks. that toy line. So, uh, you heard it first. Ron's gonna grab some dick. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna <laughs> contemplate over dick, and then, uh, maybe grab some, yeah. and then figure out what we're gonna I'll get here, but, uh, see that. that's pretty much, yeah, summing up the, the bits and buttons, Ron. This is just some amazing, yeah. amazing stuff. You're, you're in heaven right now. I know. So, dude, I'm surrounded by dick. <laughs> so for all you Migo guys, I didn't want to skimp on this or forget. There's just a lot here. Um, I know we got pulled away by Mr. OG earlier, but, uh, this is the most Mego I've ever seen on a wall, so I wanted to make sure I got it for all of you guys. I got some Flash and Superman. It's an interesting Superman. Riddler, Batman. Got some Star Trek. It's always fun to see. Ultraman. And some horror that I haven't seen from Mego, which is also pretty cool. Bride of Frankenstein, Exorcist, Pennywise, Phantom of the Opera, that's very cool. The Fly, that's amazing. Oh, I might have to walk away with some Jeepers Creepers as well. That's an awesome figure. Got Anthony Hopkins in the straight jacket, Kiss Demon. So. That is the Mego wall. You got the Planet of the Apes down there. Also awesome. But this is pretty big. I can't even back all the way up because I'm I would be backing up into Toy Biz Marvel, but uh here you go. I mean this is pretty phenomenal. I also wanted to give a little extra attention onto this Jax wall because we never see it on this channel. Um you got Hunter Hearst Helmsley back here. Brooklyn Brawler. Oh my God. It's just, look at all this stuff. That Big John Stud. That's awesome. Tank Abbott. <laughs> Billy Graham. I mean, this is just Ric Flair. Look at that, Mr. Perfect. Simply Perfect. That figure is. So. Just uh, some really cool stuff. I wish there were some original San Francisco toy maker figures. I collect those. If they had some ECW ones here, I would absolutely grab those, but I don't see any of them. Awesome. Some really cool Jack stuff. Rod's War, Rock. Maximum Sweat. Got some Maximum Sweat figures which are always very cool. Man, all you wrestling guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Have you heat? So cool. Oh, look at that Christian. He's awesome. Glow in the dark figs. Man, oh man, oh man. Mr. Ass. I don't know, this is just all pretty incredible stuff. Well, we have dilemmas here. I believe, uh, what did you just say, kind sir? I said suck my fucking monkey dick. Well, there goes the views on this video. <laughs> what do we got? Uh, we got a Rocky dilemma. This, this is this thing that like I've been staring at for like the past couple of weeks, ever since they got it, every time I come in here. Because like, little little fun fact and little tidbit is that I'm a huge Rocky fan. Yeah, you are. And, and this is like... This is like the mecca, to me, to me personally, other than owning a piece like of the Rocky, of the Rocky movie, being a figure collector, this is like, to me, like the mecca of like 
Rocky collecting. Let's see this. This yeah. is a pretty impressive. This, this this is like one of the few times you'll ever is hear that a me. Six pack. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah. This is the first time you'll ever probably hear one of the few times you'll ever hear me say. To me, this is like a personal grail. Yeah. You know, and I don't say that yeah. often, so yeah. it's like you know, for me to say that, you know, I'm like. I know. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know. Yeah. I just hooked Rocky on your video, sorry. Oh, that's great. So but, many channel firsts right now. But, but yeah, I mean, you know, you got Rocky 1, Rocky 2, Rocky 3, Rocky 4, well, Rocky 5, which everyone would like to forget about. And then you got Rocky Balboa. I mean... Oh, man. And you already picked up a three-pack, right? Well, I'm going to, so I'm like, I don't know if I might as well just take this and just, you know, relieve him of the Rocky. Are you, uh, yeah, well, that's... Look at that shelf space you'd be helping them out I know, with. right? It's just so much more extra inventory. There, Get rid of that Toy Story stuff. Um, so are you going to be opening that if you get that? Well, you are getting it. So oh, when, no, when, no, once no, you no, walk no. away with this, it. Is, this is staying that's in. A, in box. This is staying in box, and I will definitely find room to put this in my room so put it on display with the three with the three pack. That's awesome. I love it, man. I say do it. It's a G.I. You know, Joe you know Rocky kind of thing. You know day. what the funny thing is? In, in some way, shape, or form, we all enable one another <laughs> to buy to buy stuff so he's sitting there like yeah do it buy it man and i'm sitting there in my head like this motherfucker is sitting there fucking egging me on the you know oh god oh that's how it goes i know man. this would be no fun if we didn't do that to each other that is nice though it is look at this man that beat up rocky is awesome i know i know man Oh man, I opened the shizer out of this. I wouldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't do it. It is beautiful as is. You don't need to at yeah. all. I'm, I'm a sick yeah. human being, but this is cool. I mean, me personally, I would it's try. Displayed perfectly. I, I, I would. I would peel. I would try to find a way to get this peeled off that would and maybe me. do a reprint. Yeah. Of the, of the sticker. Because how often are you going to even come across this anyway? Where that's what it's I'm like, saying. Oh, like, that's, the conver that's, the conver that's the conversation we were having before. Like you know, like I feel like when I come across something that's like a once in a lifetime thing, it's like. I kind of almost have to get it. Yeah. There you have it, folks. Another happy customer. This is not what's popping. <laughs> so I am still walking around, bits and buttons. All these hours later, I'm back in the wrestling section. Uh, I just got rung up, though. I'm going to have everything that uh, I purchased today sent back to my house. So... Um, and that's going to be in over a week. So I don't think that we are going to have the haul breakdown um, in this particular video. Although I will say that the last haul video that I made, and thank you guys uh, for being so engaged in watching that, um, did really well. So I think everything that I wound up getting um, on this hunt, as well as uh, the stuff that I picked up uh, or received in a mail call um, within the past two weeks, we are going to do in a separate haul video. Um, and it's a good amount of stuff and we picked up some really cool stuff here uh, today at Bits and Buttons. I want to thank Dominic again um, for letting us in uh, on their day off uh, to film in here and to buy up some stuff. This is just an awesome, awesome place and I'm super happy and uh, grateful to finally make it here. It's the last stop of the day. Oh, it was my, it was totally my idea and the reason why it was my idea because you haven't experienced a full trip to Florida unless you've hit up a target out of your own state. I have never been to a target. Out of state. Out of state. Well, here you go. Another channel first. Let's try this again. <laughs> another channel first. Uh, it's another channel first. This is, and Mike, where's Mike? Mike. Yo, Mike, you happy about being at target or what? I'm so excited. <laughs> he's, he's so excited. Like a dream come true. Oh yeah, and what happened? Because dreams come true. Do we, does anyone need, actually need anything at this place? What no. are you doing? Legos. No. Just, oh, Legos, Legos and you? Legos? Maybe I might as well. <laughs> I'm not gonna find anything else. Oh Jesus! Christ. All right, let's go, Mike. My, my ear pods are falling out. This is off the rails. I have to document this right now. We're walking into a, the main toy aisle of a Target that I've never been to before. First time out of state. You're obviously still very excited. Oh yeah. Right, and this guy. We are down the figure aisle right now. Let's watch it professionally. We've got the watch it professionally. behind the scenes exclusive. Let's watch it professionally. This is oh, how this is done. Hey, we got you have Mr. Wonderful. Oh, Paul Peggy. Oh, we got the UFC figures. I haven't seen these. So we're here recording stuff. So. Oh, yeah. I'm zooming in. Right Here's the behind the scenes wow. of what's popping in the wild. We got Panthor. Now, some guy. I'm trying to make keeps, sure he got his shoes. Some guy keeps telling me that every time I see a Panthor, it's flopped. Um, good sir. Plastic. 
plastic. Those are Walmart exclusive, plastic. I think, the Flux. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, we got Fish Jam, we got some in there. Oh, look at this. You have, you have a spring-loaded Ram Man? Oh, Ram Man. Ooh. I have him, but I have mine has paint app issues. So I'm not actually thinking about it. We got John, Vader here. John R. Raymond Arnold. Got the Amber Collection down there. Oh, standard the Falcon and Winter Soldier Wave. Standard elites that we've seen on this channel a million different times. We've got a Vader looking pretty clean, actually. Um, what else do we got? Yeah. We've got a whole lot of got, uh, plastic Panthors, some Prince yeah, Adam on sled. We got US agent. E Man, Skeletor, Battle Cat. And we have a Ram Man, Man, though. Check this out. Now, my Ram Man has some paint issues. I might pick this up because I need a clean one. You got three out of the six now. And this looks clean, so I think I'm actually going to buy this. You might have just undercut. You might have just undercut Ron. And uh, what's he? What did he do? Uh, he found part of the Captain uh, Captain America and Winter Soldier wave. You know what? That's all you. I don't collect those. I mean, I actually, I hope you buy that, Mike. Hey. We got a G.I. Joe sighting. reason to be here. <laughs> we got a G.I. Joe sitting in Cobra Commander. He's been hanging around lately. We got some Shang-Chi. Oh, that's definitely going to be hanging around. Poor Caddy, well. or Katie, however you want to call her. <laughs> Peggy. I want to insult her. Um, that's really... Yeah, we got... So this is the first time I'm seeing this. Falcon and Winter Soldier. Marvin the Martian. Marvin the Martian. I have no interest in this wave See? whatsoever. Oh, I don't want to go in with Target. But here you go, I guys. I want to do Target. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Anthony Merry Christmas. figure looks very good, actually. So, all right. Um, there you go. It's another channel first. We're just crushing these channel first. There we go. Crushing these channel first. Now we're back inception. to doing Inception again. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, no, no. Now it's a three-way Inception. Oh, now it feels so oh, good. I'm just behind the scenes. I'm documenting. Okay, we're all documenting. Okay. I'm well, buying this. What's the first? I'm buying that. Oh, the Ram Man. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm buying it. See, you come to Florida and you find shit. Yeah. All right. Um... Uh, let's go check out the, uh, the neck. Oh, you know what? Yeah, well, You're I'm a guest. Next. You're a guest. Can we go to the NECA section? I'll let you see. Can can we go to the NECA Funko section? Can we go to the NECA Funko section? Oh, we're totally going to the NECA Funko section. Oh, thank section. you. But hold on. I oh, hey. It's a unicorn. How much is that? The Lego <laughs> unicorn. How much is it? How much is it? Yeah. It's magical, though. For you? All right. It's let's go you. to the NECA Funko section. Sure. Give it a hug. So I'm going to take this. One hug. But I got people saying that my channel sucks because I don't look at Transformers. So one Mississippi, two Mississippi, <laughs> three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi. Oh, reactions. I got to start over. One Mississippi, two. All right, let's get the hell out of here. All right. Um, what are we doing? NECA? NECA Funko section. And Barbie. Round and round we go. Where the NECA Funko section is. Nobody knows. There it is. Actually, this is sets back, but this. The cool thing is that they put out those, they put out those King Kongs. Those King Kongs aren't supposed to be, those King Kongs are street dated for um, the 20th, I think. I need, I need to check that Kong. Look at how sad this looks. It's really quick. I know you just come here to see the Billy Eilish, bro. Whoa, hey, 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 guy. That's the reason you drive with the target all the time. Whatever. Admit it. Ooh, turtles. Well, this man's off and running. I'm gonna see, put Ram Man down. Okay, right First time seeing this. Some ego stuff, Halloween, Wolfman. Mike's going hard on turtle stuff. I like that. We got Elvis. Bloody head sculpt. But I also don't need to buy this here because I will find this back at my, back in my hometown. Mike's blocking the Funko Pop stuff. But this is cool. You get the branch. That's really cool. Very nice. I think, I think, uh, shout out to Legends Collector. I think he found that the other day. He showed a post, so I'll, I'll save that for back home. But I think that's it. That's it, folks. I am going to take this guy. And if there's anything else, then I will be sure to let you guys know. Oh, hey there. Wait, oh, who is that? Who is that back there? Wait, is it spider? Spider! <laughs> spider! Now that's how you that's how you end a day on a spider. Spider. Seth unfortunately is leaving us. We have a two hour ride home. Mr. OG Long driving ride. geek over here. And uh, I can't thank these two gentlemen enough. This has been a phenomenal day. It's been a very special day. A long time coming this day has been. And uh, it has just been, it's been incredible. So I want to take 
a quick moment. Thank these two guys. Thank you guys. Oh, you're welcome. Man. Very it's much. Been the utmost pleasure. I uh, I can't wait to do this again. Going to be making these trips uh, much more frequently. So, but this was awesome. I really appreciate everything you guys did today, carving out the time, your generosity, everything has been amazing. I'm definitely going to tell you guys to go subscribe to these guys, even though. 100% of my subscribers. We got some Too Fast and Too Furious on going on over there. Yeah, Tokyo Drift, bitches! <laughs> <laughs> all of you guys, I am positive, are already subscribed. But if you're not, you have to make sure that you are. Go check these guys out. They are the best of the best in this community. Yeah, this is your first general, time so. watching this channel. Make sure to subscribe right now. Just hit subscribe yeah. before just you exit. Just, just, and, yeah. give a and give a thumbs yeah. up. And yeah. give one of these. All right? Yeah. And if you and if yeah. you want, you can comment on our nasty beards. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> my crap beard, yeah. which has been yeah. commented on. Well, it's, it's not my, crappy my, today. My, my it has been crappy my, before. My bird nest. Well, you've or, got you've or, got some issues, yeah, right? My bird nest, or otherwise, aka known to most people already known as wolf pussy. So you know, <laughs> just just saying. So. <laughs> <laughs> and there you go. This is definitely not going to get any views whatsoever. There's been so much demonetized. <laughs> but anyway, thank My you guys. Is perfect, by the way. Well, I'm actually, saying, you, know, you know what you so can title this? Look at that. Flawless. It's, it's so manly. You know what you can title this hunt? My first X-rated hunt. <laughs> <laughs> I used to have a lot, and then I tried to get better about it. But uh, we're back now, so uncensored. Thank you guys again so much. This oh, has been awesome. Right, it's been awesome to finally hang out with brother. Yeah, dude. Two years. Two years. Two years to make this happen. Two years, and it was well worth it, so <laughs> thank you guys. All right, guys, that is going to wrap it up for this one. But first, I'd like to give a special thanks to Mike, Seth, Dominic, the good folks at Bits and Buttons, the good folks at Tate's, and Target, because what's a toy hunt video without Target? Um, but on a more serious note, uh, yesterday was an incredibly special day, super epic day, a long time coming for the three of us, really. Um, it was just awesome to spend time with Mike and Seth, guys that I've been speaking to for years, uh, guys that I consider very good friends of mine. And, um, you know, just for them to take the time out of their days to come and show me around and drive me around and, and, and bring me to places that I've seen a thousand times on both of their channels that I've been dying to crawl through. Uh, Dominic for opening up his store on a day off. I mean, who's an all super awesome guy too, by the way. Um, links to all of them will be in the description below with the exception of Target. Um, I just uh, can't thank any of those guys and all of those guys enough. Uh, and I can't wait to do it again soon. Um, as far as the haul breakdown of this video, I mentioned it in bits, but if you missed that, um, I'm going to be, since this video, I think we've seen plenty of toys, uh, this video is going to probably be pushing an hour and a half, and everything that I bought at Bits is on its way home to me back in New York. But since I am still on vacation down here in Florida um, for the next several days, uh, I won't see that stuff for a while, and I wanted to get this video out to you guys. I think there's plenty to watch uh, anyway, um, but we picked up some really cool stuff at Bits. Uh, we found some stuff earlier in this hunt while we were in New York, and I have some mail calls. So that's gonna be a very good haul video um, that I will uh, cut later next week and share with you guys, uh, which I'm greatly looking forward to doing that, along with a lot of other things uh, that are coming to the channel. Um, that's different than just the outside of the Target and Walmart run grind, which is fun and has stuff that I need, and that's why I go there. Uh, but I'm happy that I have some other stuff coming your way. The vintage Star Wars video that I released, it seems like has been very well received, which is awesome because these are all things I'm truly passionate about uh, in the collecting world uh, and in my collecting world. So uh, we're definitely gonna see more of that. There's part two of that collection that I'm going to be sharing with you guys with my buddy John at Toy Wiz, uh, along with some other vintage stuff um, with my buddy John at Toy Wiz. I think we're gonna do a store tour as well. Uh, together. So there's a lot of really good stuff coming to this channel very, very soon. Thank you guys again for all of your incredible support. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you're enjoying the channel. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I will check you on the next time. Peace.